Maybe there's something about quarantine that makes everyone everything seem kind of random. But this week's video is all about random thoughts, and it's mostly so I can include some pictures of my wonderful school horses. So my first random thought, or I should say maybe realization, is that Shade, who's been at the farm since 2001, can actually recognize my truck. I figured this out the other day because I lent someone my truck and I was in the barn and all of a sudden she started running around and I came out to see what the matter was and there was my truck pulling into the driveway. I think that's a remarkable thing. I mean, I always give her treats when I get out of the truck, so of course I've trained her that way, but I'm amazed that she can recognize the difference between my truck and all the other trucks that come into this barn. I think that's remarkable. And speaking of being able to recognize the difference, if someone comes in the barn, even at supper time, who doesn't normally feed them, they get this reaction. But if you come in and you've at any time in your previous history thrown them a flake of hay, you automatically become their staff and they will tell you how it's important that you feed them straight away. It's funny because they're being so polite tonight when we're trying to film them. Usually you feel like you're working in a diner where the patrons start banging the silverware if you don't get to the table in time. But they really are trainable. I remember years ago we had a rescue horse named Talk and he had very badly foundered front feet and Joan had to teach him to lie down so that she could treat his feet. And he learned so quickly to the point where she could just come in and with just a hand on his neck, he would lie down and wait for his treatment. It reminded me of how horses always offer a gentle invitation to connection. And speaking of training, we've got a box full of bits that we keep at the farm. We just keep them around to show students different types of things that they won't necessarily see on our school horses. And it always makes me think when I look at those bits and other talk I've seen over the years that maybe sometimes the horse's willing cooperation isn't as much of a priority as it should be. Another random thought is that I remember that horses are naturally balanced and it's us that throws that balance off and I guess it's up to us to try to restore it. And finally, you realize that the old senior guys have it figured out. This is 35-year-old Pebbles figuring out how to get his nose under the tent. He knows we're watching them, and I love how he does the old, uh, oh, I'm just in here checking out the tack, you know. But finally, the smell of the grain in that bin just overcomes him, and he has to come in and grab a mouthful before we could grab him and take him away. <laughs> proves my last random thought that with great age comes great wisdom. See you next week.